I call myself to me scissor hands because I am Shem. I'm scissor. I'm Edward. Hey Slayers, I hope you guys are fabulous. My name is Dumi and this is Young, Broke and Fabulous. If it's your first time here, you are not a Slayer. To become a Slayer, all you need to do is click subscribe, hit the notification bell and the all options show. Ooh, so you don't miss a notification every time I post a new video. And if you are a returning Slayer, welcome back babe. I appreciate you. Guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you saw from the title of the video, I'm going to be trying out some of my very 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 new items like these are brand new items that i got uh enjoy the video let's start first things first this is what i got um i got this two-piece i think this is actually you no know, it was like 280 how much was this two-piece i got it from um yellow sub trading it's a two-piece that i was supposed to wear at the let's cook by fair to pull party so basically it's like a see-through mesh outfit so pretty and i'm about to do something in front of you guys so you can evidence my you can be you can be what you can be part of my recklessness but i'm not gonna wear these things as pants and if i ever do wear them as pants i will literally buy cycling shorts on the side as for now i was play i'm planning to make this like a swimming beach outfit and all of that jazz so i'm going to cut these <laughs> i'm gonna cut these off i know i don't like the shorts inside I'm not even going to give anyone a chance to tell me otherwise. So this two pieces from Yellow Sub Trading. I don't know if I mentioned or it. Yellow Sub Trading is one of my top um, places as well. I want to see if I can cut in a manner that saves it. But yeah, no. Catch you when I'm done with this. I just realized I went ahead and cut this thing and I've never fitted it in my entire life but how beautiful is this color how cool is it but yeah no i i really didn't even know it would come with pants inside it makes sense uh but i wanted it plain and then i'm gonna try it on with the swimsuit i saw and i put a huge ass plastic here because i'm not feeling it but let's yeah, so I want to put this swimsuit under because it's orange and it has one stripe of pink you'll see in the in the try-on. So this is actually what I envisioned. Like you see, this is like a swimming pool, swimming costume, swimming um, outfit type of vibe. It's, it's giving like... Um, I'm at, a, I'm at a pool party and I don't know how to swim, but I do get into the water. So yeah, I'm, I, let me take out, take off my socks. I'm wearing socks. So yeah, um, so this was definitely not a good idea. Um, I am, I promise you guys, I'm wearing a panty and the, the plastic thing is still under. I'm really gonna return this if it's possible to return it because I will never wear this <laughs> and another reason why I'll never wear it is this I do not like I want high cut like this um, I don't want hair this specific cut the two or three times I've tried to wear it and stuff I've had to give the swimsuits away or return them okay give them away not return them because wow that's it like this is this is not flattering to me i don't like it i like two pieces or if it's not gonna be a two piece like this thickness on the side is not giving for me but you see my vision so this thing has like a striped pink that's why how i got the idea to put like the pink under i can also put orange which is fine i have 
orange swimsuit i just don't have a like a fully pink one and i feel like it would be nicer with something that cups both both boobs and not this cut so no with this we are not gonna go for this but definitely yes with this i love it i love it so much oh i love it and then, yo, on Saturday we're having like a bride at the pool with my friends and I, I wanted to wear this outfit. Hopefully I can get a two-piece bikini that's pink. And affordable. I um this jean as well. I'm showcasing it because whoa, it's been getting people asking me where I got it. I got it from HM for 329. Um it's the here's the exact tag i i don't know how i just knew in the store to take the tag this is the best jean i've ever bought or owned in my life and i've been going back to h&m to see if they don't have a darker blue or whatever but most of the jeans that they have in store are um you know the the 90s straight cut mom jeans and the reason why <laughs> I want to do a specific video you guys will see you guys will see when I do a specific video on all of those H&M jeans what my issue is but yeah let's try on this jean um, you've seen already how it looks if you watched the previous video if you didn't watch you're about to see how it looks and then I bought bonjour tops these are just um, nice staples what what do you call it yeah staples things you put under your outfit and stuff like that so they i got one for 45 friend at gem clothing and it's originally from asos asos is a uk based company um if you <laughs> we've tried ordering from asos my husband had ordered most of the things from asos and then i think my birthday dress was supposed to be from there then asos got to south africa the customs are crazy the customs are like almost three thousand and we're just like nah they can take back the, the parcel so i get a lot of asos things that i own like they always bring their crop tops their tight tops and their um what what is it what what can i call those tops they bring um it's just like basic tees basics basics they always bring them at a um at jam and you get it for 40 rand or 50 rand in winter my winter haul i showed you primark and asos long sleeve shirts who, that were basics as well so i got to a black one and a white one i'm gonna try on the black one because the white is gonna get dirty so here is the bundle top just basic um, if you have like steady, firm boobies, then you don't even need to wear bra under. Um, yeah, I, I wear bra under that's uh, with a clear strap because even though for a video you've seen I do try on these tops without a bra, my boobs don't behave and I move around a lot. So here's the bandeau top 45 friend from thing. I have it in white as well. And then the H&M jean, guys. This is like, I found liquid gold. <laughs> Not denim gold. <laughs> and then it was just one item. I'll buy another one because this is the most comfortable jean I own. It's jean enough and jegging enough. It's thick. It like it holds up to here um it is an ankle touches by the ankle i like those type of jeans because i have cute legs full legs right now <laughs> so yeah i like that and um next thing i bought my mom was like you are old now you can't keep complaining about brass go back go to woolworths and get brass at woolworths and that lady was right because I got um, the the black one holds my book really nicely and a beige one so they have I'm gonna buy two every month for two it's they the other 350 or 450 I think they change depending on size but I 
because I have big boobs, I I do like a non padded bra. Yeah, they fit so well. So this is a thirty four double D. <laughs> I went there for them to measure me, but it was my last month's periods where my PMS was out of this world my boobs triple in size and then like I was just bloated and everything and they said no I should try 36 double D right so I tried 36 double D but if the bra goes up at the back and everything that doesn't it like for me it, it's uncomfortable and it's not sitting right on my frame so my bra size is 30, 34 double D and they fit very another shop that's my plug um pq clothing guys i've done a i think that was one of my first hauls on this channel look it has this like nice gold buckle it's a leather belt and obviously we know the plight of big s <laughs> so this was how much was it it was this jean doesn't need a belt anyway but i do like belts so i wear it either way this was 50 rand at pq or 40 rand yeah for this belt as you can see all these items that i'm trying on were randomly bought on different days like as soon as i get out of the house i'm buying something this Okay. yeah it's it's just a nice belt I wanted to show then oh I'm gonna wear a hat um, so I bought this bucket hat it's so cute guys it has butterflies in different colors so think of it this white crop I don't know if I should do, oh so my sister stole my white crop the, the the like the loose one so I'm gonna do a tight crop I don't mind and then a bucket head I have another pair of jeans from H&M that I forgot about and a top and those shorts from Mr. Price guys I I'm so lazy okay okay I love you slayers let me just do it okay I got these shorts high-waisted shorts Mr. Price currently has so many different shots available. Um, then what was the issue? <laughs> I wanted a dark blue, but they didn't have a size. And at that point, we were so tired. We were looking for a homecoming Africa outfit. Guys, the drama, yeah, homecoming Africa. I, yo, yo, what a moomish. Anyway, this is what I wore with this other crop that's green also don't know i got it from h&m so these shorts were 180 from mr price and they're high-waisted i was supposed to go to a nudist brown type of vibe party i i ended up wearing that brown and like different shades of brown dress that i got from light in a box so i ended up wearing that dress and it was more fitting but I still got these pants. These were 279, 280. If not 280, they were 330. I, I I can't remember, but I only wore them for a video which was not showing. And then I got this crop that's on the sales rack. It was 130 at HM. I think the original price was 200 and something. It was really a hit and miss. It's a nice top, but okay let me just say i'd be comfortable in it if i was wearing boot tape um it was even connected with uh, a thing here i cut it so i can be able to tie the top to hold tighter the arms are really cute they're really nice and then this is the jean is it's not a jeanish material it's more of a what do you call this of a stretchy jacket material as well it's a uh, light brown it's brown and then um it's also it's it falls by the ankle it has more of a balloon trouser shape so that's how this looks so yeah here it is 
not too crazy about how this top fits but i do have tons of boot tape so if i was really committed to wearing it i would just tie my boobs down and i think it would look very nice it's it's cute it's cute or you can just wear it with a bra tie around the bra just that the bra I was wearing it was visible here so i took it out so yeah H&M is my new fave, but there's what it is. Um, then I bought these slides, guys. They are so cute. <sighs> they were 330 though, but it's fine. Very cute. Um, I made one mistake I never make, which is I bought my size. I'm a size four, so I bought a size four because. I thought these were big and when I tried it on in store, my foot fit in nicely but now when I walk, it pushes my foot out which is so annoying but they are cute and then I got this bag this was really 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 because I wanted to re replicate that outfit and this was 120 from Yellow Sub Trading cute right? was it 120 or 130? yeah 130 from Yellow Sub Trading, and this is how it is. It's so cute. Oh my god, mm, the browns are browning. It's actually very nice. Am I done? Yo, I, I, oh no, I want to show you my sneakers. I'm gonna just show you two. The other ones my husband bought, I said you will see them probably in the Instagram post when I go to. When I go to Goldrew City. <laughs> yeah, no, I wish I could tell you that they are, but they are not. My husband sponsored these because I can't bring myself to buy expensive things. Hey, let me not lie. It depends on what it is. But I really wanted these sneakers. And, like, the thing is, when, once certain sneakers are released on nike.com ne? um they sell out in yo they sell out so fast and i really wanted them this is a lot of shoes for one person to have these <laughs> guys these are the style of the show my sheen cut is filled with clothes to match these sneakers because I need to wear them every time and they're so pretty so yeah that's that mm -hmm. lastly it's these pants they're high-waisted tapered pants they look straight cut and everything but once you put them on they kind of hold your leg and then they open the reason why I'm not trying this on is because I did a whole reel which I'm gonna insert where I was um, the reason why I bought these pants <laughs> was because I wanted to redo um, Sinobile's outfit and I don't know if I'm saying her name right it's I think it's a coarser name but yeah I love her style I like her aesthetic aesthetic wise I, I don't think I can I I have enough patience to reach that aesthetic um, it requires a lot of thought and you know I like that she's into her craft her craft and her feet is one of my favorite feet but fashion wise I love most of her outfits so I was just like you know what let me re replicate some of my favorite ones since yeah so yeah here's the video enjoy and guys thank you so much for tuning in please don't forget to like